Hey there. In this episode, I wanted to do a short review on a product that we've been using. And I firstly wanted to say we're not affiliated in any way, shape or form with this company. Um, it's just simply a product that we've purchased and started to use for the first time um, on this camping trip. And when we get a product that we really like, we like to share our findings with you and let you know. And even sometimes we might get a product that we're not so fond of. And if that ever happens, we'll certainly tell you um, we're not going to hold back any truth about anything that we use but in this particular case we've been really enjoying this product it's an Aussie based company I believe they are based in Sydney but I'm not 100% certain on that um, and they're called the Ute Bag oh, sorry Ute Bum Bag .com.au is their website and um, we found that we used to have vehicles that had rear tires on um, the vehicles and we have all the gear bags um, and dirt bags are designed to basically go on a rear tire but having a ute now um, we've lost that uh, ability to be able to carry something on the back and um, so Jason researched and found this company that we used and um, they've been fantastic especially what we found as well is that the design of them it's like made from a very heavy duty they call it a truck mesh um, so it's quite hard wearing um, and it's high UV protected um, so um, it, because of the mesh style as well if there are any bin juices no one wants bin juices in the vehicle which is why these bags are really great um, then it can flow out of the bags without an issue you can give them a rinse through without a problem if they are messy they're great for when you're at the beach if you've got sandy shoes or wet towels you don't have to put them in your car um, we've also uh, you can also, if you have a bit of wood collection, I wouldn't put like heaps of wood in there personally, but they are extremely heavy duty. Um, so they do say you can put wood in them to carry them back to camp. You can even put, uh, it'll fit a 20 litre drum in the back. Um, so like your jerry cans, if you don't have space anywhere else, you can fit them on there. What we really like about these as well is their design. Um, to protect the paintwork on your vehicle, which we want to do. So we'll come in and have a closer look at them. So you'll see that they have this magnetic bag on the back of the um, each, each bag. We per, we, the reason we bought two of them is um, one, so we can obviously store more rubbish if we're anywhere ever that is in a place that doesn't have a lot of rubbish we'll be able to remove it. We like to be able to make sure that we've got plenty of ways to be able to get our rubbish out. Um, and we like to, for our personal benefit, segment um, recycle rubbish with standard rubbish um, as well. Uh, but the other great thing that you can use with these if you're ever four wheel driving um, and um, you want to have quick and easy access to your recovery gear, they're great to be able to pop into these bags too. So, um, as I was saying before, the, the feature of the magnetic mat on the back is brilliant to help stop um, and protect the paintwork on your vehicle. They actually have a double zip here, so they do advertise that um, it's good if you've got something a little bit more precious. Um, as I said, it is a very heavy duty mesh. If someone really wants to get into it, they'll get into it, but you can padlock it for a little bit of extra peace of mind if you like. Um, and they're quite big and spacious inside you can see like we've got a whole box in there with some rubbish in this one and we've got a bag case in point that uh, it rained and there was a lot of excessive bin juices and wetness and so on that we didn't want to get in the vehicle it's great that we've been able to throw it into here um, the other good thing is they've each they've got like a reflective strap on there as well so it just enables a bit of extra safety to be able to see um, and you can undo them, unclip them if you like, just like so. You don't have to, but these are what this is designed for. So you unclip them like so. And then they simply come down with your tailgate. So they're not getting crushed up with anything underneath or spilling everything everywhere. If you want to have your tailgate down in any particular situation, you can have your bin so they're still upright as well. So that's a really super handy feature. 
The other great thing with them is they're designed that um, when they're not in use, because they are a permanent, uh, more permanently designed um, to stay on your vehicle, and I'll talk roughly about that in a second, um, that when they're not in use, you can just pack them up and they've got this handy little pouch that everything just fits straight into this section here and you can keep it there until you want to pull it back out again for your next time if you don't like to just leave them in place all the time. So these um, are designed according to their website to fit most Australian utes. Um, we've got a Ranger PX3 and what we found is that because um, we've got this, uh, oh, what do you call it, Jay? Tub liner. Uh, like a tub liner on the actual ute. Um, the screws that we, ha we actually had to go and source different screws to be able to fit um, this template through because otherwise you can't get, there is actual holes in the existing doors of the um, PX3, but with the tub liner you can't see them. Um, so Jason, did you have to lift that? Do you want to just explain what you did with the installation of these? Yeah, so I just lifted the, the tub liner up a bit, found out where the screw was, just put a, a drill through the tub liner, and then the uh, bolts that you need, I think from memory, are about 10 mil longer than the standard ones, which are just these type that hold it around the, the edge. And yeah, you just pick up the, um, the plastic lug that's in there and it all just locks it down um, the brackets are elongated so they will uh, accept different vehicles so whether it's a, a Triton or Ranger or um, any of them you know Colorado doesn't matter they will fit you, you just might need those extra long screws but otherwise very easy to fit great job so there you have it that is the Ute Bum Bag. Excellent product. We're loving it so far. And um, I, di I did actually see they've still got them on specials. So maybe jump on there and uh, get yourself a bargain. So thanks for watching.